How to install RP1 or RP2 charging handles on a rifle? My name is Anastasia. Welcome to Zenitku in English. RP1 and RP2 look alike but are designed for different rifle types. For example, RP1 is for AK, like AK-103, 104, 105, 74, 74M. RP1 is not compatible with AKM because AKM has slightly different bolt carrier body. It won't fit. And RP2 is designed for Vitis SN and for Saiga 9. RP1 and RP2 come in two colors, black and desert. The process of installation of RP1 and RP2 is the same, so I will show you on an example of RP1. The kit also includes a hex key. Looks like this. I can start right now, but to make the process more comfortable, it is better to take off the bolt carrier body first. Surely you can do it straight on a rifle, but you will get my point at the moment when you will start rotating the hex key. Done. Finally, the installation process. RP1 charging handle consists of five parts. There are two screws. A shorter screw is in the top opening, right here. And a longer screw is in the middle opening. After that, I remove the cover. Inside the cover there are two inside parts. Those parts need to hug the lever. They hug it. I put a cover on top of them. And after that I place the screws back. As you remember, a longer screw inside the middle opening and a shorter screw inside the top opening. Next, I can assemble the rifle. I've just finished the installation process of RP1 charging handle on AK-74M. As you see, it's quite simple. RP1 and RP2 charging handles can be bought in our partner stores. I will leave a link below the video and note here that only those stores that are stated on our website zenitco.ru are our official partners and they sell original Zenitco products. Because unfortunately, fakes exist. It's a gross violation of our copyright because we've never sold any company in the world any rights to manufacture our products. The only place where it can be done officially is at town Naginsk in Moscow region. And that's where our factory is located. So I don't want you to get tricked by unfair companies. And uh, uh, I want the best experience with our products for you. So if you have any questions on them, please ask them in comment section. I read all of them. and. Uh, if you have any ideas for maybe future topics for future episodes, also feel free to write. See you in the next episode. Goodbye.